This is a very quick demo of how I make my little tiles to be used in mosaic artwork. I start with a big block of clay and with my harp I break it down into eight pieces ready to go into my slab roller for even thickness. It goes through twice and I put it onto paper the second time, newsprint, so that the front face will be really smooth for painting. Next I apply underglaze. Um, I always paint the edges so that they don't dry out but I'll leave some patches in the middle and I'll try some different colours. Um, so I stack it up, probably about eight boards separated by tea lights. Um, I add textures and um, various techniques like um, using little bits of newsprint just to make shapes and leave gaps in the clay. Just paint them on and then pull them off using sharp implement like a scalpel. So I continue painting and adding texture and colour. That's my last sheet on about a stack of eight boards. Now it will dry out at room temperature and I have to wrap this up I leave it maybe overnight, maybe for six to eight hours, just depending on the day and the room. Um, I use sheets of plastic and uh, an old shower curtain is a good size to wrap up this big stack of boards. So leave those overnight. Um, they go through the slab roller again, which makes them a bit more pliable. Um, once they're ready, and I'm not ready for stage two just yet, so I have to wrap them up in plastic. Uh, they can all go together now or they'll dry out. And I put them painted face to painted face so that the, ter the terracotta doesn't uh, mark the nice painted uh, sheets. So there it is all wrapped up and I'll leave that to one side until I'm ready to paint. So I've got some underglaze colours here. I'll just make some random patterns. I'll dry them off using a hair dryer. And I'll put them through the slab again so I get a nice smooth face. Again, it goes on to newsprint. Um, I might monoprint some more colours onto the top or drag some more textures and patterns through. Then I slice them up. I stack them into, onto boards, put the boards on top to stop them curling. And I'll leave those for a day or two. Then they will be glazed, uh, bisked and then glazed. And then they'll be broken up into tiles. Um, or strips. Um, the scoring on the reverse makes it easy to break down into tiles and then they're ready to go into mosaic artwork.